Hey, Tony here. For today's Slipcover Saturday, I'm going to show you some retro slipcovers from Walmart, so stick around. So recently, Walmart put out some new slipcovers featuring some retro style um, slips for some really good movies They have and some TV shows. They have Blu-rays and they also have DVDs. So I made two trips. The first trip I was just focused on the Blu-rays that I wanted in the collection because typically with Walmart slipcovers, I only go for the um, Blu-ray slips. But with these, there were some DVDs that I needed in the collection that haven't had a Blu-ray release. So I ended up picking up a, a second trip with some DVD slipcovers. So first up, we're going to show you the Blu-ray slipcovers. We have Smokey and the Bandit. Uh, three movie collection with these three films. I've always enjoyed the Smokey and the Bandit films, so really happy to have these added to the collection. And then I got the Lord of the Rings, um, the Motion Picture Trilogy. Great looking artwork on this one. Of course, I've already got the Lord of the Rings films, but I did want to get all of the Blu-ray slips that were in this line. One of my favorites that they released is The Mist. Really nice glossy slip. It is a two disc um, collector's edition. So very happy to have this one. I did not have this one in the collection. Um, I got The Gate. So this right here was a previous Vestron release. And so it's nice to have a new slip for it. And we have The Lost Boys, um, the three film collection. I already had this one in the collection with the other slipcover. Um, but it's a great way for those that don't have all three films to be able to get this. So very happy to have this one. I really do like the artwork on it. Another great one is Highlander. They seem to release Highlander quite often. Um, this right here is another one. This is a really nice glossy slip. I really enjoy Highlander. So nice to have another edition. And then of course they always release the Rambo films. So I got Rambo 5 movie collection with this really nice looking slip. It has all five films. So that was my first pickup. Like I said, I was just focused on getting the Blu-rays. Um, and then I decided that I wanted to go ahead and go back and get some of the DVDs. I did not get all of the DVDs. There are series that I didn't really want um, that I've already got in the collection. So really the DVDs were focused on the ones that I do not have in the collection already. So I got Scooby-Doo Monster Movie Collection. It has eight Scooby-Doo films in it. So very happy to have this. The Free Willy 4 film collection. I only have Free Willy in the collection. So this is a great way to add the other three films in. Not that the other three films are any good, but I, I do like having all of the um, franchise together. Okay, we have The Land Before Time, five movie collection. Um, my kids grew up watching these, so of course we watched them. And so it's nice to have this one. Um, of course, I only have The Land Before Time um, on Blu-ray because that's the only one that's been released on Blu-ray. Then I have Beethoven, um, the complete collection. Has all eight films of these. I have Beethoven and Beethoven Second on VHS, and I have Beethoven on um, Blu-ray, but I didn't have any of these other ones. Then I have Rugrats 3 Movie Collection. Of course, this is another one that my kids grew up watching, so we watched. There is a Blu-ray release of this that I had forgotten about. So this one right here is probably going to go back because I really would rather have the Blu-ray release for this. In the same way with the Peanuts 4 film collection, um, when it, it was called Peanuts 4 film collection, I really didn't pay attention to the films that were included in this. But all four of these films have already been released on Blu-ray in this Snoopy collection. So I'll probably be returning the um, Peanuts for movie collection because I've already got this on Blu-ray. But those are the um, titles that I picked up for these retro slipcovers. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about these particular titles. 
And also let me know if you were able to pick any of these up because I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and on Twitter. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.